We got some binoculars. When Minnesota Marines look through their warehouse at the toys they'll give to kids in need. I wish I could show you more. They can't believe the near empty bins and boxes. While donations to Toys for Tots do fluctuate year to year, this December is the worst they can recall. We definitely didn't have it like how it is now. In the six days since toy collection started, the Marines say their supply is down 25% from this time last year. Typically, a truck packed full with donations comes to their Minneapolis warehouse every day. This year, it's come just three times, and they're especially low on gifts for older kids. We're always going to get uh, toys for children from age ranges from three to five all the way up to six to seven, but from eight to 15 is what we struggle with the most. Here's a list of their biggest needs, many of them for teenagers who are often overlooked. The Marines say some donors find that age group harder to buy for, but you can always make a cash donation. But gifts for all ages are sharply down so much that even kids themselves are trying to help. Some are giving away their birthday presents, sharing both their toys and the holiday spirit. They come here to the warehouse and they donate all the toys they got at their birthday parties. It helps us uh, realize that it's worth it. People across the state of Minnesota are working hard to solve this problem, stepping up to give toys. Just this morning, more than a thousand people dropped off toys in an event through 93X Radio, and we've got a steady stream of people dropping off toys tonight here at the CARE 11 tent. Remember, there are drop-off points throughout the Twin Cities, and we have a full list for you on CARE11.com. And of course, Randy, we want everyone to come to our CARE 11 tent. We'll be here ready for drop-offs through December 16th. Love those guys at 93X. All right, thank you, Janelle.